Hmm. Wie geht's denn da eigentlich hin? Kann man hier tauchen? Nee. Wo war der sogar nicht tun? Ticket! Go on, you have my approval. Hm. Ich hoffe jetzt mal, der Typ ist nicht wirklich noch ein Verräter. Das wäre schon hart, wenn dann ein neuer kommt und dann auch noch. Wollt ihr diesen Fisch nicht mal verarbeiten? Der gammelt da schon seit Ewigkeiten rum. Und schauen die an. Ah, da ist die Kleine. Adele, we're back. We brought you a gift from the court too. Wow, thank you so much, boss. Don't call her boss, okay, Adele? Just Miss Navia would be fine. Oh, it's all right. I don't mind. Besides the gift, I've also got another surprise. Guess who's here? It's been a while! Hello. Oh, it's you two. It has been a while indeed. Thank you so much for your help on Jacques' case. I've heard that you also help save all of Fontaine. You're truly just like the great heroes of legend. You're really amazing! And if Miss Navi is your friend, then she must be super amazing too. What's in this thing? Can I look? Of course. Go ahead. Oh, it's a Spina di Rosula uniform. Is it for me? But isn't it a bit big? Well, it's a gift for future you. When you first told me that you were interested in joining the Spina, I was overjoyed. But it's the Spina's responsibility to protect everyone as well. Being a member means becoming involved in all kinds of dangerous situations. And since you're still young, I don't want your mom to have to worry about your safety. So I turned you down then by telling you that you'll have to wait until you're older. But this uniform is a promise. That you can join us once you're old enough to wear it. Oh, so that's it. Well, thank you so much, Miss Navia. I'll work hard and grow up as fast as I can. <laughs> uh, but you can't really grow up faster by working hard. You've got to be patient. Everyone, I'm really grateful that you remembered my daughter's wish and took it seriously. Thanks to the protection of the Spina, Even though her father's no longer with us, we've still felt plenty of warmth and security. Oh, it's the least we could do. As long as you live in Poisson, even if you're not an official member, you're still part of the family. Boss! Huh? Is something up, Florent? I've got something urgent to report. Romeu and his folks have gathered outside Poisson and even shipped in a huge pile of explosives! What? Explosives? What do they want? It seems like they've been planning this for some time. We started investigating as soon as we received your letter yesterday. But Romeu and his folks must have gotten wind as well, because they abandoned their former posts before we could even check on them. We investigated their tracks and found out that they're after Poisson. They have smartened up since we caught them red-handed at the court? Seems like they've got no interest in sitting down and talking at all. We should have gone straight to the Maison Guardianage. Sorry, I, I <clears throat> underestimated the situation. Well, too late now, I suppose. Florent, where are they keeping their explosives? On the hill to the east of Poisson, near the Clementine Line. Moment, das bedeuten? They want to blow up the Clementine Line? Certainly sounds like it. Romeo and his followers hate the Spina and everything to do with Callus, and the Aquabus was the source of their contention. If they manage to blow up the Aquabus line, 
all that rubble will come crashing down the hill and straight into Poisson. Are they insane? There's tons of innocent people in Poisson. Müssen sie aufhalten? Yeah. If they've been planning this for ages, they're definitely not going to let this opportunity slip by. We have to issue an evacuation order to the townspeople and get them as far away from the entrance as possible. That should save them from the worst of it. Let's get everyone onto our ship. That should be the safest place. <sighs> My dear partner, can I leave the Clementine line to you? If the explosives do go off, not only would the people of Poisson be in danger, any aquabuses using the line would plummet to the ground. Let's stop their insanity first, then settle the score with them. In order. Leave it to us, Navia. Please stay safe too. Let's go, you two. We've got to act fast. Miss Coralie, please take Adele to the ship. Watch out, boss! Der Wichser, Alter. What do you think you're doing, Coulter? I thought all the annoying little hindrances had left, but I still couldn't get rid of you. Uh, you mean this was all a trick? So that you'd be left alone with me? Oh. <laughs> I get it now. You knew about their plans all along. You only told us they were doing badly so that we'd drop our guard. Not quite. Though I share their positions on some issues, I've never cared for his more radical ideas. And that's because, out of the entire Spina di Rosula, I only hate you. Only you, Navia. Oof. You better stick close to me. Romeu promised me that he would leave Poisson alone if I could just take you out. But it was like you were glued at the hip to that pesky traveler. You never gave me a chance to make my move. Romeu has lost his patience. I didn't have to be here today, you know. But I swore that I'd kill you, even if it meant being buried with you in the rubble. Why? Only someone as clueless about the past as you would ask such a foolish question. You never saw the heyday of Spina di Rosula, nor did you ever live through the golden age of Poisson. But I, I saw it all with my own eyes, and then I had to watch it all die, little by little. And it was all because of you, Navia. Clementine died because of you. Callus died because of you. Melus and Silver died because of you. And so many more died. Dead. Everyone dead. All because of you. So the shock and grief you showed us before, that was an act too? Now you're catching on. I heard Malus was dead the moment I got out. Did you know, down there in that blasted fortress, I spent a long time thinking about what happened and resolving to apologize to Malus as soon as I got out. Back then, because of that aqua bus, we had a huge fallout. I was convinced that all he cared about was loyalty, and that he had completely lost his capacity for critical thinking. The years passed by in a blur after that. I thought I had finally begun to understand him, and that he could help me relive the good old days again. But then he died, and it was because of you again, Navia. It's always because of you. <laughs> I once loved the Spina and Poisson more than anyone else. But what is left now of either besides death and ruin? You've single-handedly destroyed everything that was beautiful. Everything I've ever loved. Don't listen to him, boss. He's just spouting nonsense. Have you ever considered that maybe the people around you don't actually care about you at all? Have you ever considered that maybe you only get respect because you're Callus and Clementine's child? That you've never done anything worthy? That you're just a big nothing? Have you ever considered that maybe people don't stay in Poisson because of you, but only because they have such beautiful memories of the past before you came? Because if you do falter, there'll inevitably come a time when you'll have to face the consequences. And when that time comes, 
those most precious to you really will throw themselves in front of you. <laughs> yeah, looking back on it now as an adult, I can hardly believe how patient and kind everyone was. But is that really why they support me? Is their kindness real? Shut your mouth! I, for one, really like Miss Navia, and my mom loves her too! Uh. I don't know how to explain it, but I like her, and that's that! I'm sure Mr. Malouse would be extremely disappointed in you right now! You've somehow managed to pin the blame for every mistake and tragedy in our history on the boss herself! Get out of the way, Thoron! I don't want to hurt you. You're gonna have to! Boss, there's no time for this! Stop hesitating and get out of here before you get buried! Maybe you think you're being the realist by painting the history of the Spina and Poisson like this. But the love that I felt from everyone was just as real. I felt it. They've helped me get to where I am. And even now, I will continue to believe in that love. So let me show you just how much I love the Spina di Rosula. Hola, it's like Steve. This one's got your name on it. Coming at ya. Coming at ya. Attack. That's the way. Oh, das war schon. Wow. Laurent, I'll leave the town to you. Summon the other members and help with the evacuation of the townspeople. If you find any of Coulter's accomplices, subdue them quickly and don't give them the chance to harm any ordinary civilians. I can't allow my partner to face the danger on the Clementine line alone. Also, er hat ungefähr 50 Charaktere dabei. I'm on it. <laughs> Are you okay, Navia? I don't know, but I have to go. Kurz zuvor sind du ein paar Minuten vom zum Eingang vom Postor gerannt. Let's hurry up there. We have to protect the Clementine line. If they're gonna blow up the waterway, they must have planted the explosives next to the support pillars. Ja, wo kommt ihr her? So, wenn wir die Energie aufladen. <laughs> These must be the explosives, right? And this is the control mechanism. Uh, how can we disable it? Oh, I'm too scared to touch any of this stuff. What is this? Schlüsselloch. There's a strangely shaped hole here. What is it for? Oh, that certainly sounds possible. Uh, maybe one of the people we just beat up has the key. Okay, you take this side. Paimon will take the other. Let's see what we can find. Oh, das war schon. Hallo, lass mich, lass mich hingehen, die Kamera. Jetzt. So, trotzdem die Umgebung geprüft, nur für den Fall.
Leave the rest to me. Watch out, Navia! You can't block them all! <sighs> Luck! <laughs> I'm doing this the Spina way. <laughs> Der Reisen in Game nur wirklich die flexible Elemente einsetzen könnte. <lacht> wäre auch nicht schlecht, auch wenn ich das so nicht benutze. Wenn man so kann, oh, wäre da, okay. War aber eine coole Sequenz. I heard from Thierry that even they're your enemies now. They were once a part of Spina di Rusula. Do you plan to settle this privately with them? I have nothing more to say to them. Regardless of whether their hatred and anger towards me or the Spina was justified, anyone who's willing to endanger innocent civilians is no longer sane enough to even be worth trying to talk to. Please, prosecute them in accordance to the law. Spina di Rosula will not raise any objections. Sounds good. We're very appreciative of your help. Without it, the consequences would have been far worse. All right, this operation is a wrap. Take him away. Yeah. <lacht> Luckily, we were just in time. Siehst du ein bisschen blass aus? Fühlst du dich ein bisschen müde? It's probably because I expended too much elemental energy at once. I'll be fine. Don't worry about me. Uh, but you usually glow up whenever other people compliment you. Paimon's not used to seeing you like this. Boss, we managed to catch all the infiltrators in the town. The Maison Guardianage is taking them away as well. Seems like Romeu really went all in on this mission. If he sent literally everyone he had, though, that also means we've caught them all, too. We won't have to worry about them from now on. Ah, got it. That's good, at least. <sighs> Coulter. I can understand how you feel. The things that we lost, they're forever beyond our grasp now. And I am not callous, and I will also never become him. The Spina and the Poisson that you loved are both gone. But I will not change how I feel about our future. I still believe that this is a great opportunity to start anew. I will spend more of what the Spina earns on the betterment of Poisson. What's more, I'd also like to propose some changes to the Aquabus routes. So that one day, the people of Poisson will enjoy the boons it brings as well. I know what you're trying to say. Mr. Callus would never have said anything like that. There are too many things in life that are just beyond our control. In that, we are the same. Henceforth, you are no longer a member of Spina di Rosula. But once you're discharged from the fortress again, you're welcome to pay another visit to Poisson. Thank you, Navia. <laughs> As I thought. Boss really is a kind and gentle person. She is also, I must say, a truly unlucky person. Thank you for protecting the Clementine line. I was actually really scared, you know. I mean, even the Callus line won't be getting rebuilt anytime soon. If I'd lost the Clementine line too, I wouldn't know how to live with myself. A name is a way to etch a memory onto the world. Losing the line that bears her name, that I can see every day. 
would be like losing my mother all over again. Seeing it still standing there, tall and proud, it makes me really happy. What happened while we were gone? Honestly, you look more upset than tired or anything. Just give her some time. Schon gut, jetzt ist alles in Ordnung. Ich bleibe dich zurück nach Puzzle. Mm. Thank you so much. Can you give me a hand? I really don't have much strength left. Traveler, I want to ask you something. And please, tell me the truth. Do you really see me as your partner? Of course. Oh, that's good then. Hearing that, it brings me more relief than I can say. Ah, was für ein Wichser, Alter. Aber das ist wieder so das typische Genshin, wie man es ja vorhin schon gesehen hat. Wie Any better after taking a break? Mm. I feel quite a bit better. But I should probably still rest for a few more days. Sorry, partner. I said some weird things earlier. Uh, feel free to just ignore me. Ja, ich finde es so, weil du vorher nie an dir gezweifelt hast. I used to think that I'd never doubt myself. You could say I've discovered that I'm not as strong as I thought I was. Coulter mentioned my parents, as well as Malus and Silver. It's all thanks to them that I've made it this far in life. Do you think they ever regretted the choices they made? Has my existence made this world a better place? Don't think like that, Navia. You've already done more than enough. No matter what others think, we'll always support you to the end of the world. Well, since it's ended up like this, I suppose it's time for me to make a confession as well. Oh, mach keinen Scheiß, Alter. There's something that I've been keeping from you as well, boss. Please, follow me. Everything is already prepared. Sie ist mit auf der Statue. Uh, Florent, I hope you can understand that I can't deal with any more shocking revelations right now. Don't worry. This surprise will be a pleasant one. Ich muss auch hoffen, ich dachte schon, alter Scheiße, nicht jetzt der auch noch. Mit irgendeinem Käse. Na, ah, da oben ist was. Oh, jetzt soll ich wieder hochlaufen. Na, ah, das sind die ganzen Leute von... Die, die fünf Stück. Why is everyone gathered here? And what's this? This was supposed to be a gift to you from everyone in the town. We were originally planning to show it to you once it was finished. But special times call for special measures. I've never seen you look so defeated before. So I've decided to show you the designs before the final product was done. I do I really look that bad? Well, if you're ready, I'll unveil the present. Hmm. <coughs> oh, die Mutter hat auch so ausgeschaut. Is Papa, Mother, and me. 
<lacht> okay, Alter, ihr Vater sieht halt einfach nur aus wie so ein fetter Superschurke. Oder Dracula. Wir haben den Look von Miss Clementine based on old camera records. As well as personal recollections from members of the Spina. Wow. This is the statue you mentioned before? It is indeed. To be honest, we decided on the design a long time ago and gave the sculptor permission to begin working. We only asked Boss to decide on a design so she wouldn't realize we had already started. How could we only have statues of Mr. Callus and Mrs. Clementine? Even though Boss is still young, we've all seen the work she's put in regarding the whole synth business and the rebuilding of Poisson. We wanted to commemorate her contributions with the statue as well. I don't know what Spina di Rosula was like in the past, but I know it's a great organization now. With Navia around, we're not worried about this place's future. We're gathered here today to tell our boss that we support you and believe in you wholeheartedly. I believe everyone is here for you, not the glory days. That's what we believe as well. Ich werde immer an die Freundschaft zwischen uns glauben. Thank you so much much everyone then i'll be brave and just accept everyone's support for what it is this really is quite the surprise i never thought that i'd have the chance to stand next to my mother not even in my wildest dreams oder er könnte auch einen hut tragen oder so so ein musketier hutner wäre so oder zorro oder irgend sowas Das schaut doch cool aus. Braucht man dafür so einen Metallbeschlag? Das hat man auch so aufspannen können. Die verwenden echt gerne Schrottmetall. It seems like I started to question myself a bit too much. I'll pick myself up again and become a more reliable president. For looking back on it, I am honestly embarrassed by how I acted earlier. Das Geschenk der Einwohner. I'm sure everyone longs for that one thing in life that seems trivial to others. But they themselves can never obtain. To me, that would be a family portrait. I've always been super jealous of other people's family photos. I've never thought I'd receive a family portrait of my own. Especially not like this. It seems like I'm not such an unlucky person after all. Hey, warte mal, war da nicht noch was, was ich noch sagen konnte? It seems like I started looking back on it. I am honestly embarrassed by how I acted earlier. Über die Frage ist es möglich, dass deine Partnerin. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Why do you have to remind me? Please don't say that again. It's super embarrassing for me. Oh, forget it now. Please forget that I ever said anything. Oh, wait. But it'd also be bad if you were to forget it. Okay, but please keep it a secret between us from now on. Please don't ever mention it again. <lacht> das sollten wir gleich nochmal machen. Ja. Schön, schön. Ich finde, der Vater echt immer noch wie so ein Vampirkönig ausschaut oder, oder irgend so ein Superschurke. Wie der Mr. Evil. Ich verlange eine Million Dollar. Da unten der Kleine immer noch über die Brücke ohne Geländer. Aber für das, dass der das, 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 das mal zu einer Metropole ausbauen wollte, ist es ziemlich abgefragt. Ich meine, hier sind fünf Häuser, Alter. Zwei, vier, ja gut. Sechs Stück. Ah, sieben mit dem da hinten. Also gut funktioniert hat es nicht. Außer dieses riesige Schiff hier. Ja, war eine schöne Quest. Das Einzige, was mich halt jetzt an der Quest stört... Ich meine, die Navi hat ja in den letzten Dingern schon echt viel mitgemacht und hier ist so... Ah, nur mal feste drauf, Alter. Hier ging schon scheiße, noch mal drauf. Das ist, was einfach Genshin immer zu gern macht. Jemand geht schlecht? Wie wär's, wenn wir ihn noch mal aufs Trans draufdrücken? Warte, was? Ihm geht's danach noch schlechter? Schauen wir doch, dass wir es noch mal draufhauen. Ja, das hätte jetzt nicht unbedingt sein müssen. Ich habe jetzt halt am Anfang gehofft, dass er, dass er wenigstens durch den Typen nochmal einen neuen dazu bekommt, der sie so unterstützt wie die anderen zwei. 
Die Stadt von Navia braucht definitiv mal Besuch vom TÜV. Ja, das ist sowieso. Ich meine, schau dir die Brücke an. Die werden ein bisschen geschwankt, dann landest du da unten. Oh, Genick gebrochen. Ups. Und ich will mal gar nicht davon reden, wie viele Fische überall rumliegen. Das kannst du nicht mehr verkaufen. Ich meine, gut, jetzt liegen sie wenigstens wieder in den Kisten, aber... Und sorry, aber... Einen Stand komplett unbeaufsichtigt lassen, während hier zwei Katzen davor hocken. Ja. Ja, klar. Die müssen die echt mal ein bisschen hier die... Da müssen wir auch mal das Gesundheitsamt vorbeischicken. Hey, schaut's ja aus, Mann. <lacht> Der TÜV würde halt TV abschließen. Der ist sowieso. Ich glaube, die Fische haben die von Liebe. Nee, die, die fangen die doch selber. Die haben ja auch überall Ausrüstung rumliegen und Taucherinnen und keine Ahnung was. Geht's da eigentlich irgendwo hin? Naja. Oh